Typical closet setup between two bedrooms. Five by two, single door, what a waste of space. At Hardcore, how we look at things is, let's sacrifice four inches from each closet in the middle, move that separating wall, open it up, create a shoe drawer cavity. We create a shoe drawer that's a vertical drawer that's basically eight inches wide, 16 inches deep, 80 inches high. Allows you to put 11 pairs of shoes, skis, snowboard, what have you. You organize everything so nothing's all cluttered on the floor. Now, why single doors? Let's go double doors. So we'll put double doors, you get full access into the closet. Let's take it one step further. Let's throw mirrors on the backs of the two doors. So when you're looking into one side, you could actually see your backside on the second mirror. And that's how it should work. Now, when we look at this cavity of the, the three and a half inch wall, now we figure let's throw a, a shelf there. But on this case, we actually put a whiteboard. One side we put a whiteboard so you can actually use it. We actually routed out a channel so you can actually put the pens and they won't fall out. And it's a great idea. It maximizes wall space anyway. So it's great for kids. On the other side, we decided to put a built-in, eight inch deep built-in shelf and it allows you to put uh, all the books that you want, photo albums, what have you. It only takes up two, three inches of the space in the inside of the closet there. It's a great idea. We're maximizing space without taking any space from the bedroom itself and we're organizing things. So let's build this now. Um, all you gotta do is reframe this, treat this as a like a window opening, a door opening, jack, king studs. We also build the shelving inside the closet. So we'll do uh, center shelving. We'll also do a double rack for shirts and jackets. We'll do a long rack for coats. You've got the shoe drawer that goes right in. You've got the doors. And this is what it starts to look like as a sketch and as a drawing. And then it turns into reality when you're looking at this. And this is maximizing space. I mean, this is gorgeous. This is organizing stuff. This is how it's supposed to be. You know, we haven't taken one square inch of space from the bedrooms. We've maximized all the square inches in the closet area. So both sides of the room, this is what things look like. So a whiteboard on this side, you had a built-in shelf on the other side, you've got the mirrors on the doors. It's how everything should work.